Hello everyone, I'm Lynx4 and welcome to Wrong Channel, another new indie horror game that was just released on Game Jolt. Now this is a pixelated point and click kind of horror game. What is this? Where am I? Hello? So I'm very interested to see how it's gonna be. What was that? Wait, what? There's something around. Large object. Touch? A door? Yeah, this is very weird because I can't see anything. And it might, in fact, be glitched. Because it's all black. Small objects. A candle and matches. Okay, I found a candle and matches. Oh, now I can see. Okay. So we got a bookcase over here. I guess I'll look at the books. Three books. Uh, sparsely decorated. Decorate the bookcase. Okay. Number one. Look at all the pages are blank. Number two. The text only is on page 34. It reads, I made her cry. The apple tree. The book is sealed shut. The spine reads 12th edition. Okay. I don't think I really need those. And a tel television. Now, <laughs> this game is called Wrong Channel. An old CRT television. I'm not sure if I... Channel zero, 00, static, just static. Television controller. Will this thing still work? Uh, channel? Oh! Okay, so I have to figure out what channel I have to put the TV on, I think. So let's go back to this one. Page 34, I made her cry. I don't think I want to go to channel 34. All the pages are blank. The Apple Tree, 12th edition. So we got 12, 34, and 1. Let me try to push the door, it's locked still. Okay. So, I think I'll just try channel 1 first. Wait, I don't think that's how it works. Channel 01. Did it work? It might. All right, that one didn't work. Channel 12. Oh, channel 12 actually worked. Okay, we got a carving over here. The heart is carved into this tree. I plus five forever. 15? I plus five? The word ever has been crossed out. Okay, ever at I plus five four. Let me see. Oh, it worked. Okay. So we got some graves here. Here lies Iris Thorn, the apple of his eye. 2012-1984. So what's that? Um, sixteen. 28 years? Okay. A pedestal. The pedestal has a small indentation, but it's not telling me anything. And the other brain. Here lies Sid Thorne, till death do us part, 1981 to. The year is no year of death. 1981. 1984. Oh, it actually worked. Okay. A weeping woman stands in the corner of the pool of the room. Talk. Hello? Are you okay? She doesn't want to talk. Hello, are you okay? No. A weeping woman stands in the corner of the room. Well, that's all I got to go on. Uh, look at the TV. That's all I got to go on. Now, the weeping woman is on page 34 of the second book. Good work. Oh, I did. Now I got a painting. Okay. Look the maze. 
The painting depicts a simple maze. The bottom left corner is coming away. Alright. The liquid. The painting looks like it's of a droplet of some sort. Alright. The words. The painting is a page with words on it. How is that supposed to help me? Seventy five. This is my house. Seventy five. Well, I recognize the room and not this goblet. Take. Goblet. All right. I'll take it. I don't know how I got here, and I don't know why everything's in color. I literally tried every single number. One through 75, and I finally made it to 75. I took the goblet, and now I have to guess another number. Well, I, it, I know it's nothing. 1 through 75 because if I put something like 64 I will literally go back to that room that was 64 so let me go back to 75 I have no idea how the puzzles are from now on I don't know, know what the answers what they could be this is my room but I do have an idea what's going on I know this overall story but I'll get to that after I figure out what channel I have to get to next on the pedestal. Give it to the crying lady. You want the goblet? I got a goblet. Oh, I can give you a goblet. Please forgive me. Goblet full of tears. A weeping woman standing in the corner of the room. Hello? Are you okay? She doesn't want to talk. Are you okay? Well, I gave the whip weeping woman the goblet. Is the door open now? Still locked. Oh, let me see the bookcase. Oh, book one plus goblet. The labyrinth. Words are appearing. Rise. Right. Fork. Oh my god. Rise. Right. Fork. North. There is a freaking sound in the distance. The handle broke off. A round metallic door handle. Well, I never did that before. Handle on the pedestal. There is a grinding sound in the distance. Grinding sound in the distance. Okay. So, the grinding sound in the distance. We already know to give the goblet. What is this thing? Stairs? Not yet, not yet. I gotta give the goblet over here. Goblet full of tears. There you go. I gave you the goblet full of tears. Still not gonna talk to me. Let me go read the first book again. I haven't done that yet. And then I'll try going up those stairs. And I have the words written down already. Rise right, port north, just in case I need them, I don't know. Well, let's go back to the stairs that magically appeared. And let's look at them. A set of stairs leads off into the distance. Okay, let's walk. There are four ways to start this journey. Uh, left, center, right, go back. Rise, right, rise, right. Rise, right. Even though it's writing as in writing, I believe maybe that would be the right way. A crossroads appears. Now the port is north. North would be center to go straight. I hope. 
Wrong channel. Left? I don't know where left would come from. A final choice must be made. Well, we went right, we went left. Maybe we should just go center. Huh, doctor. Your father has been like this for weeks. Doctor. He wasn't... He hasn't said a word. Mrs. Thorne. He still blames himself. But my mother's death... It wasn't his fault. He'll do... We'll do what we can. Thank you, doctor. Alright. So... Sid Thorne. Wrong. Okay, so what I've thought up to this point is that there's two people. It was the Mrs. Thorne and Sid Thorne right here. And they were like together forever and something like that. But then the wife died. And he lived on and she's crying. Because for some re Wrong channel. Wrong channel. Dad? And this is the daughter, obviously. Wrong channel! A really confusing... <laughs> game over! <laughs> what do you mean? It said thank you for playing, it's not game over. Well, the game is over. But that was wrong channel. A really confusing kind of puzzle game. I had... I really got stuck about the number 75. I can't figure out why I got the number 75. Or why that was the answer. I literally went through, was playing at least over an hour. I've been playing this game over an hour. You said it would be 10 minutes in the description. The guy said it would be 10 minutes in the description of the game. I've been here for over an hour, but I will edit it down as much as I can. I liked it. I wish it was a little bit scarier, really. And the puzzle, a little bit easier to get. But the story, if you're just thinking about everything, the story really comes together. And you don't have to, don't have to tell anything. So that really worked out. The graphical style, it was it was alright. It worked for the game. Point and clicked. I liked it. I just wish the scares were there and I had the atmosphere. The sound was great though. The game was, it was a pretty okay game. I mean, if you can figure out why it was 75, go ahead and try. I, I can't, I can't figure it out. But anyways, thanks for watching. Thanks for out. Oh, why do you have a giant flag and you don't put anything in the Oh, oh God! Oh, oh. oh! Oh! Oh, 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 oh. Okay. Oh!